Cambridgeshire farmer Will Womwell is out of hospital after being on the wrong end of a metal bar wielded by an illegal hair corser. It happened soon after harvest when Mr Womwell encountered a number of people trespassing on one of his fields. Four guys got out of the car, um, one went for the dogs they'd left in the field and the other three decided to be quite a bit of fun sport to turn themselves on me, um, which they did to some effect. Um, one of them managed to hit me in the ear and the other one, I don't know, I just had a bit of metal bar that swung at me. I, I sort of managed to move out of the way, but he caught me on the end of my snout. My brother managed to get his truck between me and the hair courses. Um, and I jumped in the passenger side of his truck to get a lift back to my truck, which was only 50 yards. But I think if he hadn't have done that, I think I'd, they wouldn't have stopped until I was in a bit more of a worse state than I, I am. Um, and yeah, 14 stitches later, it's sort of getting itself back together. We've really been targeted. As soon as the combines are leaving the fields now, we're being chased by hair courses. Um, some of the fields that they were coursing in on Wednesday had only been combined a matter of hours. The police are doing what they can. We're very fortunate um, here in Cambridgeshire that we've got the Rural Crime Action Team, um, the RCATS team, who are, in my view, invaluable. If the Rural Crime Action Team was to go, it would be very near anarchy in the countryside, especially around here. I've had the hair course I've been chasing that have just driven through a fence onto the M11, straight down the bank and onto the hard shoulder, and likewise coming off of the M11. We're digging trenches and putting bales in gateways, um, putting more gates up, and it's yes, costing a fortune, but ultimately one man with a chainsaw is cutting a hole in a hedge and they're, they're still getting on the land. So what, what do we do? This is Johan Tasker for Farmers Weekly in Cambridgeshire.